This is my second builded hot bulb Indian. Built it 34 years ago in 1991. The bore is 20 mm and the stroke is 20 mm too. And the fuel is kerosene. My experience in building model hot bulb systems in those days were rather modest. So I tried to copy the system from a big engine and after many experiments with different types of hot bulbs and different kind of fuel, I got the engine to run rather properly. The engine is water cooled and the water circulate thermosiphonic with no water pump. This is a cooling tank and this is the pipe connection to the Sudenta water jacket. The injector, this one, must be water cooled. This is the pipe connections to prevent the fuel from boiling because the injector is direct mounted to the hot bulb only separated by a heat resistant gasket. The hot bulb, this one, is heated by means of a blow torque. This is a gas bottle for the blow torque and the flame must be burning all the time the engine is running. The flame must be adjusted properly too much heat and the engine will pre-ignite and too little and the fuel will not be vaporized properly and the engine will stop. The flyball governor controlled injection pump system on this engine is more or less the same as I use on my engines today. I will light the blow lamp. And it must be burning for some time before I can start the engine. Then I use the flame properly at about there, I think. Let's see if it's warm enough, the hot bulb, to start the engine. So it was. A couple of smoke rings. Now shut off the blow lamp and the engine will stop. <laughs> 